this Pro America's Voice News break live from CPAC 2024. Ashley Babbitt, most of you know the name, she is the face of January 6th, one of the many faces, and her mom, the people's staff, is here with you now to talk more about the nightly vigil that happens not just to your daughter, but for all of the political prisoners. Talk to you talk to you We have a nightly vigil outside the D.C. jail uh, for 571 nights now. We stand outside, you know, our, our American patriots are still being persecuted behind the events of January 6th. I've uh, seen the National Anthem every night at 9 o'clock, they're ready to sing it with them. Anybody that wants to join us, 1901 East Street, uh, we're there every single night. Um, you know, we need to stand up for our people that have been politically persecuted. We need fair and just trials. It's not our position that we're going to do anything on that day, but we want the government and the police to be here that day. Uh, please call us accountable as our American citizens. 571 straight days. That is a habit. What keeps you going back tonight? Well, my daughter was an amazing American patriot, and you know her life was so rich and accounted for so many things that you know I have to uh, be in pursuit of justice for these for everybody as well as my daughter because if I take these people justice for the American people, I'm not going to let my daughter suffer. I want to give you your roses while I can. Uh, we were talking, we were saying the president of the United States is going to be here tomorrow. This is for your daughter, but it's bigger. It's absolutely bigger than anything. You know, so many people are sitting in jail right now. With enhanced misdemeanors, uh, and getting seven and a half years to show up on the press. No, no violence against the police, didn't go into the Capitol. Uh, many people did, but many people didn't. And some of these people are have seven and a half year sentences for merely showing up. Picketing and parading is one of the charges. You know, if you don't accept a plea deal, they enhance your charges and, and they, they uh, supersede your charges and put more on. So there's really a felony trial tax. So we're asking Congress to go in there and observe what happens in these courtrooms as American citizens. Uh, well, we appreciate all that you do and your continued support. I mean, how can people support your cause? Because it's important to keep Ashley Dodd's You can go to forashley.com. We have lots of links to lots of sites. Uh, you can also go to Patriot Mail Project. You can find any single uh, J6 detainee, and you can donate to the commissary. You can write them a letter and tell them about them. They can have them. We appreciate all the work that you've done. Thanks so much for being here. That's going to do it. Let's get you back to the Charlie Craig Show. Free J6! Awesome. <laughs> God bless. Beautiful, Mickey. Well done, baby. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> All right. You want to go get lunch? God bless you, honey. You did great. It was awesome. Yeah, it was good. It was good. <laughs> but I understood but, but, everything you said because that's how I think. But it was comprehensible. Absolutely. You got exactly. a lot in in a short period of time because they don't give you long. No, you only have and, like a minute. And it was understandable. <laughs> what? You were talking too fast. <laughs> I love y'all. Nice. Taylor, get it, Mickey. Get it. Oh, I'm so glad we got up here just in time. Yeah, our timing was impeccable. Who was walking around on a cane? Yes. So, what's the consensus? Is he allowed to walk around with the cane? Wait, watch this. Is it live? He has dropped the cane. Let's do it, Ivan. No, no, I don't even know if I want to see this. Big Daddy Cane, ready? Oh no! Wait a minute. Oh, that is not even funny. And I'm like totally zoomed in. You just can't keep the man down. Let's just give him a hand. <laughs> I gotta go gracefully. There you go. Look at that knee. You have not been released from PT. I know you haven't. <laughs> Amen. You are too much. God bless you, honey. <laughs> just don't climb up any trucks anymore. Oh my gosh. Ivan, I did send you that video, by the way. Which one? Um, oh, that was you? Yes. That went nuts so with Steve Bannon? Yes. Yeah. That was me. <laughs> Did I get the message out or what? <laughs> and I sent you a clip of that, or a photo of you up in the back of the truck with the guys. It was a good shot. So I, oh, I sent yeah, it on yeah, your, um, yeah, your text message. So, oh yeah, Jennifer is Glory B. Glory B is Jennifer. <laughs> Virginia Beach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please don't do that anymore right now. No, <laughs> some. 
I no, no, I'm on. talking about climbing up the back of the truck. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> go up there. That's you about give me a heart attack, man. I'm telling you. Start doing stairs. Huh? How's it feeling? Good. I'm not on any payments. Okay. Good for you. Awesome. That's a good thing. All right. God bless you. We'll see you later. We're going to lunch. Okay. You ready? I mean, you don't have to come if you don't want to. I'm ready for lunch. No, I am too. Okay. And the we have gentleman in the hat that's Ivan is going to try and make it to the picture tonight. Oh, good. Oh, that's great. Oh, I'm so glad. Okay. Oh, that was a great way to end the stream. Yep, it was. And so this video, um, I will post it later. God bless yeah. you all. Glory be to God. We are at CPAC 2024 in Washington, D.C. at the Gaylord Hotel. It has been, we're day three, and it has been an interesting experience. So more, more to come.